In this short video, I'm going to demonstrate how Adobe After Effects can be used in conjunction with a web front end to allow for a fully automated motion graphics production ecosystem. First thing that you do is you type in your video title, and then you select whichever template you would like to use. If you'd like, you can click on the play button to get a preview. It'll open up in a light box to give you an idea of what the finished video is going to look like. When you're happy, you make sure that it's selected, and then you go up to the next button. On the next page, you'll see that your video title is there, and this is where we upload the assets. The first thing that you do is select the images. You can use your own assets or website assets. In this case, we'll use some local assets. I'll select all of those pictures and hit open, and you'll see that they'll upload and be represented by thumbnails as they get submitted. At this point, you can also enter text text here, spelt that wrong, and you can do that for every one of the images. Same thing with the audio asset. You can either use your own audio file or some of the site audio file. In this case, I'm going to select a little country music. You can preview it before you select it, and when you're happy with it, you can hit the confirm button. I'm going to hit the preview button here, and at this point, the web front end will create and submit an XML schema file to a folder that After Effects is watching. First, let's take a look at what the schema can look like. Here's an example here, and you can see that all of the assets that would have been submitted are representative in the schema file, along with uh, any other options that you would like to have within the XML schema. Now, let's see what happens when the XML goes into the watch folder. You'll note that After Effects automatically picks up the file, ingests the text and visual assets, and renders the file. There's no user intervention required at all. It's completely automated. So, with the render completed, the movie file is returned to the user for confirmation and changes. When they're happy with the product, it's passed on to be shared via social media or played back via your content management system. And that is a short overview of how a fully automated graphics production ecosystem can work using Adobe After Effects as a host application.